did unlawfully and with malice aforethought commit murder in the first degree of Placer County Detective Michael Davis. We find the defendant guilty. Unexpected yet emotional verdict and a heartless reaction from the accused as a jury finds admitted cop killer Luis Bracamontes guilty of gunning down two local law enforcement veterans. The illegal Mexican immigrant shot and killed Sacramento County Sheriff's Deputy Danny Oliver and Placer County Sheriff's Detective Michael Davis Jr. during a 2014 crime spree. Good evening. Thanks for joining us. I'm Tony Lopez. And I'm Christina Janes. Now, Brancamontes faced a total of 15 charges. He was found guilty on all counts and five special circumstances. The confessed cop killer could get the death penalty. A decision on that, however, will come down sometime next month. The sentencing phase begins on March 5th. CBS 13's Angela Greenwood was in the courtroom today as the verdicts came down. She's here now with an inside look at the courtroom drama. And Tony Christina, as you mentioned, the verdict today was not surprising. Luis Bracamontes admitted to these murders multiple times, but just hearing it read brought some closure and some healing to the loved ones of these deputies, despite even more disturbing behavior from the convicted killer today. We find the defendant guilty. Guilty on two counts of first degree murder. It's a very good day. Confessed cop killer Luis Bracamontes, now a convicted killer in the 2014 murders of Sacramento County Sheriff's Deputy Danny Oliver and Placer County Sheriff's Detective Michael Davis Jr. Sacramento County Sheriff Scott Jones was inside the courtroom as the verdict was read today. There's really no joy. Um, it's more of, I think, a, a quiet satisfaction. Nothing can bring Danny back, and, and so for that, there will always be that void. Ladies and gentlemen of the jury, is that your true and As the jury verdict? handed down the convictions, the killer once again showing no remorse, smiling, laughing, blowing a kiss to the crowd, even pretending to fire a gun toward them with his finger. And as he walked out of the courtroom, he threatened to do it all again. This killer is a despicable human being. But most of Sheriff Jones' focus was on the heroes in this tragedy. He and dozens of deputies joined families and friends of the fallen peace officers, some who cried, others who embraced as they walked away from the courtroom. Not ready to go on camera just yet. They tell us they're so grateful and happy this part is over. Is that your true and correct verdict? So say you all. An illegal immigrant convicted of killing two local sheriff's deputies. It's a step toward justice in what still, more than three years later, is a tragic and senseless loss. It doesn't make this one any less, and it doesn't make it go away. And, and I think all of us here in the department think about Danny uh, every day. And the jury will next decide whether or not Bracamontes should be given the death penalty. Again, that phase of that starts March 5th. This has been, though, obviously a long road for these families, and you could really see that relief as they walked out of the courtroom today. Painful journey. Mm -hmm. Angela, thanks.